Solve the quartic equation. x plus 3 all to the power of 4, plus x plus 1 all to the power of 4, equals 82. The equation has two quartic terms. x plus 3 all to the power of 4, and x plus 1 all to the power of 4. Which are powers of a binomial? Binomial theorem. x plus y all to the power of n equals, the sum from k equals 0 to n. n choose k times x to the power of n minus k, times y to the power of k. We can use binomial theorem to expand the terms. This will result in a standard polynomial equation, with a degree of 4. Solving a standard polynomial equation, with a degree of 4, sometimes might not be easy. We will use a simpler approach to solve the quartic equation. As the middle of x plus 3, and x plus 1, is x plus 2. So we let y equal x plus 2. Then x equals y minus 2. Substitute x equals y minus 2 in the equation. x plus 3 equals y plus 1, and x plus 1 equals y minus 1. So the equation becomes y plus 1 all to the power of 4, plus y minus 1 all to the power of 4, equals 82. By applying binomial theorem, y plus 1 all to the power of 4, is equal to y to the power of 4 plus 4y cubed plus 6y squared plus 4y plus 1 and y minus 1 all to the power of 4 is equal to y to the power of 4 minus 4y cubed plus 6y squared minus 4y plus 1 4y cubed and negative 4y cubed cancel 4y and negative 4y cancel so the equation becomes 2y to the power of 4, plus 12y squared, minus 80 equals 0. Divide the equation by 2. We have, y to the power of 4, plus 6y squared, minus 40 equals 0. The left side of the equation can be factorized and written as y squared minus 4, times y squared plus 10. So either y squared minus 4 equals 0 or y squared plus 10 equals 0. For y squared minus 4 equals 0, we have y1 equals 2, and y2 equals negative 2. For y squared plus 10 equals 0, we have y3 equals i root 10, and y4 equals negative i root 10. As x equals y minus 2. So x1 equals 0. x2 equals negative 4 x3 equals negative 2 plus i root 10. x4 equals negative 2 minus i root 10. So there are four solutions, two real ones, and two complex ones.